50th Anniversary of Apollo 13 Avoiding Disaster by Learn With News, Level 2 Apollo 13 was the third NASA mission to try and land on the moon. Apollo 11 was the first mission to land on the moon in July 1969. Apollo 13 went to space nine months after Apollo 11, launching on April 11, 1970. The astronauts on Apollo 13 were Jim Lovell, Jack Swigert, and Fred Hayes. On the way to the moon, six minutes after they finished a TV broadcast to Earth, there was an explosion. The explosion was in the oxygen tanks, and it destroyed a lot of the ship, which was supposed to take them to the moon. The explosion in the oxygen tanks meant Apollo 13 had lost a lot of its oxygen supply. The astronauts had to go into the moon lander to survive. The moon lander was only designed to land on the moon. It was not supposed to be used for travel through space. NASA and the astronauts had to work very hard to turn the moon lander into a lifeboat. The astronauts and NASA had to solve many problems to return to Earth. They had to turn off the power to save the batteries so they could land on Earth. This meant they had no heating for days in the very cold space. They had very little water and could only drink 200 milliliters per day. The conditions in the spaceship were very bad. One mistake and all three astronauts would have died. Thanks to the hard work of the astronauts and NASA on Earth, Apollo 13 returned to Earth on April 17, 1970. In 1995, a movie called Apollo 13 was made about the disaster. Tom Hanks played Apollo 13's captain, Jim Lovell.